We know it's Viva After Dark. We've got pretty girls sitting in a sweet <laughs> ride out here under the lights. Hi, I'm Duke. And I'm Lola. And this is Bossa Nova Life. Today, once again, we're back. Yes, yes for Viva Las Vegas 26. We're going in Friday night before the big Ooh. show on Saturday. We're going to be checking out a bunch of these cars under the lights. And then towards the end of the video, we're going to be showing you the daytime on Saturday. Viva After Dark. <laughs> Today, fine sir. Oh, very good. Thank you so much. My name is Stefan. And where are you from? San Diego County. <laughs> San Diego County. And what have we got here? All right. What we see here is a 1961 Dodge Dart Phoenix. It's a Tudor hardtop, sky high rear window in it. Man, wow, it's amazing. It has the original engine in it with uh, two by fours. Okay, so you left that in there. We left it in. I can show you if you want. Oh yeah, I'd love to see that. It has a push button automatic transmission, as you would expect from this year. And it's basically the last array from Virgil Exner of styling with reverse fins and all the craziness that's oh, going on. My gosh, that is gorgeous, man. Mm -hmm. That is really, wow. That it's is just a nice Definitely over carbureted from factory. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no question about it. You can never have enough fuel, right? <laughs> that's right. Well, that's one has enough, that's for sure. So, did it come in this condition? Yeah. No, no, no. I, I mean, I bought it, I bought it uh, right after Christmas in 2020 from a friend up in okay. Oregon, Poland. Okay. Poland, that's, our, that's my neck of the woods. Was the paint on it? Anything like that? It was partially painted, um, so I had to repaint a lot, but it was a basket case. It was uh, basically the body with some axles underneath and everything else had to be fitted. There were some parts missing, which was a nightmare to find. I can only imagine it's not a super common car. Well, I know, let's say it this way, I know pretty much all the junkyards <laughs> between Nevada, Arizona, and California. Thank you so much for bringing it here today. I know everyone else is going to be liking it as much as me. Thank you so much. Thank I appreciate you. that. Most of the people don't know what this is. <laughs> and you guys are all matchy matchy yeah. for a little yeah. Viva After Dark action. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. I love Viva it. Viva Las Vegas up all night. Holy, <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Good, good, pretty good. Part yourself. My name is Candelario. I'm from Tijuana, Mexico. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. You brought this right up? Well, I'm in Vegas now. I've been in Vegas for 25 years, but I'm okay. from, from Tijuana. So, uh, what have we got here? Uh, this is a 1950 Deluxe Convertible. I pretty much, I got the car kind of like 90% the way it is right now. Mm -hmm. I swapped the wheels, did a couple of things. I striped it. I do a little bit of painting, but this one was primer like that. The gentleman that had it mm -hmm. did a good work keeping it. You know? he, did a, he did a nice yeah, job on the a flat coat. Yeah. yeah, they uh, put a 290 on it, mm -hmm. 350 transmission, open, open drive line, G-body rear end. So the car drives, you can drive 80 miles 
on the freeway like no problem. No problem. It's just a, it's a beautiful machine, you know. The guy kept it well, so I'm leave it. I'm gonna leave it alone. I like <laughs> I like it how it sits. So this one, I got lucky because normally I build cars, frame up, but this one it was a. Uh, yeah. I cheated on this one. So. Yeah. All right, and man. And the most yeah. important part, you drive this thing. Right? Yes, of course. Yes. yes. Keep it on the road. You like. You have to drive it. Yeah. Like that. You Every, drive I, that's what I love this show because a lot of the people they drive from Utah, yeah. California, Arizona. Yeah. So it's a car. It's got. It's, it's meant not, to be Not drive. a lot of trailer queens at Vietnam. Oh no, none of them. <laughs> yeah. There we go. You need to be delivering like tequila or ice cream to people while we're like that. Oh, yeah. I know. <laughs> The man is back. What's happening? How are you doing, man? Good, how are you? You do still have the hula girl on the dash. Uh, yeah, hula girl on the dash. <laughs> got tile floors we're featuring this year. Oh, you stepped oh. up. Oh. I like that. Look at that. Is he going to put a, like, a little commode in there? Have a no. restaurant? <laughs> no, no, hey, hey. Mitzi's slaying as always. This is what you get after dark at Viva, folks. <laughs> the magic after hour. Viva after dark. <laughs> I'm assuming you're the owner of the Frankenford. Frankenford, yes. <laughs> so what year is this? That's uh, 1936. 1936, yeah. right? I love the rye rod, but Thanks. you kept it pretty, pretty basic. Not yeah. nothing too crazy. Not yet, no. All right, you're not quite the Franken yet. It, it's pretty franken though. <laughs> yeah, it's got stitches. It's got uh, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. It's a Chevy underneath, a Ford on top. It's got a little bit of Dodge in it. It's so got we run under the hood. It's the uh, it's the Vortec from the Chevy. It's a '95 okay. Chevy. Making Mike into this place? Fucking A, dude. This is my place. How you doing, dude? I love you, brother. <laughs> convertible the cars under the lights does it get better than this Lola no look at this this is amazing and then there's that Vegas skyline over there That's right and there's yeah. about to be another 200 cars coming in don't, don't hop off yet oh no I had to push her today <laughs> <laughs> She decided to die. I was pushing her through an intersection. You pushed this car through the intersection? Yes, it was it was ridiculous. This is called dedication to Viva. In that hair and that dress. My, so one day I wore pants. I wore pants for three days, and this morning I was like, I'm gonna go on the breakfast cruise. And then it quit. <laughs> and there's no shame in my husband's game. He's got the scar for the quad, and I was like, he's not pushing the car. <laughs> See, here's the joy of me going to Viva Las Vegas for 13 years in a row, is I already knew that this guy was going to have a cigar in his hand 
while he was cleaning Washed this piece. <laughs> <laughs> How you been, man? Oh, yeah. Good. It's looking, it's looking righteous. <laughs> Thank you. It's the man, the myth himself. How's it going, brother? I'm doing well. <laughs> About to go over here and sign some autographs, take some pictures. They yeah. want me in the magazine again. That's, that's yeah. right, you know. The uh, Thunder Down on their show is trying to get me to join their what, revenue I mean, again. I can't, I can't do it. Yeah, I, just, right. I can't do it. The Nobel Peace Prize is next, and it's so much. It's you know, just so much. You find the cure for cancer, and everybody's I mean, come on. Just something simple like that. Yeah. No big deal. No big deal. Yeah. You know. <laughs> Are you enjoying Viva After Dark? I am enjoying Viva After Dark. Well, we'll find another ride she's in love with. Uh, you gotta see these sparkles. I don't know if she has a favorite, <laughs> but I know she has favorites. Look at the sparkles on that. Oh, yeah. See if I can on pick it up. There, the seats are crazy sparkly. I'm hoping the camera's picking that up. So pretty. Wow. Lola approved. <laughs> That is a crazy looking one. Right. That's one of the prettiest El Caminos I've ever seen. <laughs> wow. Well, my interior is all bulk. And then the door panel is our panel. Everything you get with the carpet has got this. Gold sparkle seats. Prettiest rides out here. Lola, is it a coupe or is it a gasser? I don't know, but he killed the owner. 1950 it's so speedster. Fast it killed the owner. So, yep, so fast it killed the owner. Man, that thing must move. It's like it's got the original motor and everything. Hi, what's your name? Eddie Bash. And where are you from, Eddie? Las Vegas, Nevada. Las Vegas, Nevada. We got an amazing ride here today. And what is it? A 1955 Ford Panel. Wow, I love it. And you said it was customized by someone else. Rick Murray, out of Colorado. All right, and you picked it up about six months ago? Yep, yep. I traded a 62 Thunderbird for it. Wow, this yeah. is outstanding. It's full custom. Crazy. I'm assuming the 62 Thunderbird also must oh, have been pretty yeah, amazing. Yeah, it's full custom too. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say this. No way he's cut loose of it for this. Yeah. Chrysler front end, heavy motor, hollow seats, Cadillac tail lights. I, I mean, it, it, it's been fully done. You, you go through the whole car. It's just. It's incredible. This is very much a Viva car, custom culture, top to bottom. I'm in love. Got the swivel seats. Lola, it's got swivel seats. I always like it just swivel seats. <laughs> wow. That's great. 
I even caught the steering wheel action on this, but I don't think I shut the dash, so let's... Alrighty. Oh, go ahead. Alright, I'm just, I'm just like, if I fall on it, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so excited that you're here. I saw this amazing ride during roll-in and I'm like, I've got to catch this lady. Aww. So what is your name? My name is Lona Aguirre and I'm from Lancaster, California. We have a 51 shoebox mm -hmm. and it's my baby girl. Her name's La Muerta <laughs> and she has a little bit of everything in her. She's very uh, uh, artistic, <laughs> obviously. And um, we have a little bit of Cadillac in her. We have Oldsmobile. Um, we have, um, it's been chopped, channeled, and it has been stretched five inches. Wow. And she's um, amazing. I love her. Yeah, this is true custom right here. Yes. So did you do it yourself? Did you have someone help you? Um, well, it was, when we purchased the car, it was okay. already down to what we needed. Okay. And then what happened was it was a flat mat, um, just black. Okay. Black. And um, what, what I did is I told my husband I need it to look like a girly car <laughs> and I like bling so so this guy right here was helping you yes he right. did <laughs> and so I made sure I put a diamond shifter so he never drives it <laughs> but yes we, we asked our artist to um, make it really girly I gave it to him and said do whatever you want the only reason why it's so orange is because the Oldsmobile front right here mm -hmm. um, the dash was orange and I love that orange. And I said, do whatever you need to do, but I want you to match that. Keep That's the orange. only thing that was yeah. orange. Yeah. So we were able to do that. And then you got the, the, the custom uh, power scooter yes, and, and the, the other scooter, one. Yes, the scooter and we have a little car here. <laughs> um, and we love it. We, you know, my kids are all grown and we decided, you know what? They're all gone and now it's about us. Yes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I agree with that. Well, <laughs> it looks like it's a fun ride. It's your dream car. Yes. It and you is. hope they're making it happen? Yes. I love it. Yes. Like I said last night, you don't have a favorite car. 
Uh, I do have, have a lot of favorite, favorite cars. cars. <laughs> <laughs> See the, the Facebook post? When, when you run into the cameraman and he's wearing your t shirt, you know you're winning. Uh, yes! But, so, got some cars and tiki bars, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Love it. We hung out with this guy in Austin for Lone Star. Yeah. We're interrupting this video for just a few seconds to let you know about our all new design from Big Toe Art. Big Toe, the famous lowbrow tiki and rap ink artist, has created a new design just for us custom cars and tiki bars. This piece was designed exclusively for Bossa Nova Life based upon Big Toe's infamous work, Ruby's Dilemma, with the tiki characters coming to life in a classic custom car. Get yours today and get ready for adventure. Available for a limited time only in your YouTube shop here or follow the link in the comments below. Get yours before June 30th. The troublemaker, that's who it is. I do know this lady. How are you doing? Well, thank you. We got all the pinups here today. sled right here, the Galaxy 500. Yep, Tell you. us a little bit about it. Uh, it's a 64 Galaxy 500 uh, LS swap, so it's a full resto mod, 4L60E transmission, uh, exhaust and interior, air ride. Other than that, that's about it. Sounds like it's amazing to drive, though. It is. So is it a daily driver, or are no. you parking it a lot? No, it, it sits in the garage. Unfortunately, oh. I work too much, but uh, we do try to get it out from time to time. You work too much. I, I hear you right there. That's yeah. what we're talking <laughs> Yep. Well, that is a slick ride. Gold and cream is my wife's favorite colors, so thank you so much, man. Here is something you do not see every day. An original moving van from the 40s and 50s. Wow. They just drove these things into the ground and then they turned them into scrap and turned them into Hyundais and Nissans after that. But somebody kept this one still on the road. It's incredible. The size of it is out of control. And he brought that sweet ride I filmed last night. Oh wow, you can see the fixed it up and everything underneath. A lot of work going into it. Oh my god, I'm so excited. It's you actually, we, 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 we found the Viva Glam and the Viva Baby. <laughs> <laughs> They're first Viva. I love it. The glasses are on point too. I, I was telling them about how this is Viva. After dark. After dark, I know. Wow. This is yeah, we're going back to our beautiful how old we are. And we're meeting. drinking tequilas. Thank you, fine sirs. <laughs> what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. We, we got we got pretty ladies. We got dazzling cars. We got great music, which I'm gonna have to turn off before it gets copyrighted. But we're having a great time. <laughs> yeah. Bossa Nova. 